I'm tired of just riding the train like the everyday Joe, so I drove it this time to go to Mino in Osaka, a place known for its waterfalls and its maple leaves, two very specific things. The longer you spend in Japan, the more you realize that everywhere is famous for at least two things, no matter where it is, no matter what it is. There's probably a place that's famous for toilet paper somewhere. The waterfall was beautiful, but it was way too hot and it was a three kilometer walk to get to it, so you already know what's gonna happen. Ice cream, but not just any ice cream. This is special Mino maple leaf ice cream, which honestly I wouldn't have pictured to be noteworthy, but then they hit me with a twist that I wasn't expecting. They put a real fried leaf on top. I don't think I've ever eaten a leaf. Not since that time I was a kid and used to mix magic potions in my backyard with rocks and dirt in a water bottle. The ice cream itself was a little bit more mild in flavor. I was expecting some super crazy maple punch, but it tasted like vanilla. Maybe that's because I was expecting maple syrup flavor instead of maple flavor. While I was there, I grabbed a big maple leaf too to give it a full review. The fried maple leaf was super crunchy and it was kind of good. Heavily battered to I guess mask the fact that it's a leaf. But after the fried part was done, it just straight up tasted like a leaf. So I guess in reality, the delicious part was just the fried part. And the leaf is just a leaf.